Hello everyone, welcome back. So today I'm doing this preventive maintenance on this train. It's a split air conditioner with a furnace. And I just wanted to show you real quick what a system that is operating correctly on as far as the refrigeration cycle looks like. We already talked about kind of when you have a bad TXV, when you're low, some other scenarios, but this is what a perfect scenario looks like. So if you see here, I talked about how your subcooling is the first thing you look at because the manufacturer tells you that this system should have 11 uh, plus or minus three degrees of subcooling. So it's pretty mild out, so it's normal that the subcooling is on the lower end, which is eight, um, you know, or seven, close to eight. So essentially your subcooling is good, right? So then you go on to your next step, which is this chart. And every manufacturer has their own chart. But you see here it says, you go off of your liquid temperature, which according to this, my, my uh, clamp is telling me it's 75. So at 75, and the subcooling they recommend is about 10. So 75, you go over to 10, and then you kind of meet across, and that's 255. I mean, that is right on the money, you know. We are, I mean, we're solid. You know, and, and then when you get more familiar with how systems work, uh, this particular unit does not have the information as far as what the, what the suction size should be. It used to be in here, but you know, somebody lost it or whatever, they didn't put it back. But it would tell me, it would tell you, you know, to pick your, your wet bulb, which, um, I do have, but um, it's it's um, too far away right now. I'd have to walk over there to the air handler to get... It's not picking it up right now, but it would tell you the wet bulb. And then you do the same thing. You kind of cross-reference it. You know, you, it tells you the wet bulb. You give it the outdoor temperature. Similar graph to this. And then you meet halfway, and then the suction would be that. But, you know, after years of experience, I can tell you that typically in this area... Of Phoenix, Arizona. These are very, very normal temperatures. Superheat is 18. Suction is 118. That's very, very standard. Okay. So I just wanted to show you kind of what um what a system that is working exactly the way it was designed looks like. So let me know what you think. Um, and thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next one.